hey guys welcome back to next gen blog uh, and in this video i want to show you how you can create a dynamic text shadow effect in vscc free video editor now it's actually super easy to create a dynamic text shadow effect in vscc so without further delay let's get started and see how you can do this now to demonstrate this first i would like to add a rectangle object on top of the screen so go to add object select rectangle and now click on ok now mark your rectangle object on top of the screen like this and then click on this option which is set the same size as the parent has. Now next what we need to do is we need to write some text on top of the screen. So go to add object, go to text, click on text and now click on ok. Now mark your text object on top of the screen like this and then click on this option which is set the same size as the parent has. Now let's write some text inside the text box. So let me just write, let's say text. Now let me just center align my text by going to paragraph and then selecting center. And once again going to paragraph and then selecting center align. Let me also change the font of my text from Arial to Montserrat Black. And let me also increase the text size from 60 pixels to somewhere around let's say 500 pixels. Perfect. Now. I would like to change the color of my text from black to white. So let me just select my text and now click on this text color option and select the color white. So since my background is also white, that's the reason my text is now not visible on screen. Now next what you need to do is you need to double click on the text object and go to video effects, go to nature select shadow and now click on ok now currently the duration of the shadow effect is the entire duration of my text object in the timeline which is 10 seconds so i would like to decrease the duration of my shadow effect from 10 seconds to 2 seconds so insert the duration option you need to write 02.000 and then press enter now look inside the shadow effect settings which is present inside the properties window Inside long shadow, currently false is selected, so change this from false to true. Inside light angle, currently the value is 45 degree, so instead of 45, you need to write 45 semicolon 45 and then press enter. Inside shadow distance, currently the values are 10 semicolon 10, so you need to delete these two values and instead of 10 semicolon 10, you need to write 0 semicolon 1000 and then press enter inside shadow color currently the color black is selected so that's fine inside shadow blur currently the value is zero percent so that's fine as well inside add noise currently false is selected so that's fine as well and so now if i just quickly play the video for you watch the dynamic text shadow which kind of comes on screen Perfect. One final thing which is left to be done is you need to create a duplicate of this shadow effect. So click on this shadow effect, press Ctrl C to copy it and then press Ctrl V to paste a duplicate. Now place this second shadow effect right after the first shadow effect like this and increase its duration from 2 seconds to 8 seconds. Perfect. Now look inside the shadow effect settings of this second shadow effect and you need to make couple of changes. So inside light angle, currently the values are 45 semicolon 45. So instead of 45 semicolon 45, you need to write 45 and then press enter. Inside shadow distance, currently the value is 0 pixel. So instead of 0 pixel, you need to write 1000 and then press enter and that's it. And so now if I just quickly go back to the main editing timeline and if I just play the video for you. Perfect. So this is how you can create a dynamic text shadow effect in VSCC free video editor. Do let me know your thoughts in the coming section below. Like the video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I will again see you in the next video. Till then thanks for watching.